One of the biggest culprits responsible for the warming of planet Earth is carbon dioxide. Side note, another has been said to be hairspray, which I'm sorry to say I'm using less and less of. I mean, the ozone layer isn't the only thing that's thinning up top. But let's pivot back to the carbon. Now, one new technology is set to help prevent a climate fail with a massive carbon inhale. This is Orca. No, not the whale. This Orca is an enormous machine that sucks nasty carbon dioxide from the air and pumps it into the ground. It's one of the newest weapons in the war against global warming. I connected with innovator Christoph Beutler in Zurich, Switzerland, to learn more about this first of its kind system. Hello and welcome to Innovation Nation. Hi, Bob. It's a pleasure to be here. What was the motivation for creating this giant air-sucking machine? Well, Mo, the Earth is warming really, really fast. And the reason is because we have put too much CO2 into the atmosphere. We need to, first and foremost, reduce emissions. And the emissions that are unavoidable, we have to then take out of the atmosphere. And that's the reason behind Orca. Surrounded by mountains in Iceland, Orca, which means energy in Icelandic, is what's called a direct air carbon capture facility. Its job is to remove heat trapping CO2 from the air and return it to the earth. How does it work? Yes, so in, in very simple terms, it has a specific filter inside that only attracts CO2. And once the filter is full, we then pump the CO2 underground where the mineral conditions in, in the rock cause it to turn into stone. How much carbon dioxide can it remove from the air? Walker is eight collector containers that are each the size of a 40-foot shipping container. Together, remove 4,000 tons of CO2 from the atmosphere. That's just under 9 million pounds per year, a tiny fraction of what's needed to stop the planet from warming, but proof of Orca's ambition to help the world reach zero emissions. We're already planning our next plant, which is 10 times the size of Orca and the one after, which will be 100 times the size. Thanks for joining us and clearing the air. Thank you, it's been a pleasure, Mom.